My name is Harold York. I'm a research scientist in Pasadena, California, and I'll be talking about how to calculate the wavelength of the first three lines in the Balmer series of hydrogen. Hydrogen is the simplest element that we know of, the simplest atom. It consists of one proton and one electron. Now, this atom can be in discrete energy states, and we describe the discrete energy states by the quantum number n, where n is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. Now the lowest energy state is n equals 1, so if I look at the energy, it's negative uh, minus 13.6 electron volts for n equals 1. The n equals 2 level now is then 13.6 divided by 2 squared, or 4, and that is minus 3.6. 4 electron volts, and so on. We can describe each of these energy states by this one quantum number. Now, when a hydrogen atom changes state, it goes from a higher energy state to a lower energy state. It emits a photon, and that photon has a certain wavelength, and this is what we're trying to calculate. So the Balmer series is the series of possible transitions from n equals 3 into n equals 2, or n equals 4 to n equals 2, or n equals 5 to n equals 2. These are the first three transitions in the Balmer series, and they each have a discrete energy uh, change going from n equals 5 to n equals 2, n equals 4 to n equals 2, or n equals 3 to n equals 2. And now, now let's calculate that. For the case of the transition from n equals 3 to n equals 2, we call this transition H alpha. That's the first line in the Balmer series. And we can calculate the energy difference by uh, subtracting the uh, n equals 2 state from the n equals 3 state. And this is 13.6 electron volts times 1 fourth minus 1 ninth. The second line in the Balmer series is called H beta. And H beta is from the n equals 4 to n equals 2, and that energy difference is 13.6 electron volts uh, times the difference of 1 over 2 squared minus 1 over 4 squared. And similarly, for H gamma, that's the third line in the Balmer series, the energy difference is 13.6 electron volts times the difference of 1 over 2 squared and 1 over 5 squared. These numbers we can work out, and once we know the energy difference, we calculate the wavelength by using Planck's constant h, which is 6.626 times 10 to the minus 26 centimeters, times the speed of light, which is 3 times 10 to the 10 centimeters per second, and we have to divide by the energy difference, not in EV, but in erg. So the first three lines in the Balmer series are H alpha at 656 nanometers, H beta at 486 nanometers, and H gamma at 434 nanometers. And H alpha, that's red color, H beta is cyan, and H gamma is a blue color. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed how to calculate the wavelengths of the first three lines in the Balmer series of hydrogen.